So I'm that guy who has bought the core rulebook and supplemental material for the last couple of iterations of the Shadowrun role-playing game, yet have never gotten together a group of people to play a game with. I keep doing so because I love Shadowrun. I've read the novels, I've played the SNES game, and I've spent a lot of time planning campaigns in my head. There's something about the mix of sci-fi and fantasy all set in Seattle, near where I'm from in the US, that has always appealed to me. It's amazing I haven't played Shadowrun Returns sooner. For a CRPG, Shadowrun Returns is quite linear in its progression. This is far from a negative. What it means is that you're sticking to a central narrative, following its twists and turns, and only taking small breaks to complete some side quests in whatever location you find yourself in at the current moment. The rest of the time is spent reading flavor text, conversing with the locals, and engaging in turn-based combat. Since I made a dwarf adept, who received a ninja costume a ways into the story, I was having a blast running up to guys and punching them to death with chi hands, all the while dodging any point-blank incoming fire. With two other titles in this style, Dragonfall and Hong Kong, I can only imagine that they are similar regarding play and stringing along the player through a tale of intrigue set in the Shadowrun universe. That's not to mention all the well-made fan modules that would be available. If I had the time and didn't have so much other gaming on my plate, I would be playing through all of them. <laughs> 